Hello my friends and welcome to Tom's Tinkering and Adventures. So today I am currently in La Jolla. Let me show you the scenery here. So I went on a motorcycle ride today with a couple of friends. Uh, just under 200 miles. Went out in the mountains, caught the edge of the desert, and now on the beach. And that's one of the niceties about riding in San Diego. And uh, stopped for a little bit of, little bit of ice cream. And uh, now I'm just hanging out here in wonderful La Jolla on the beach. So I was thinking about swinging up to a, a place that I really like around here. It's called Mount Soledad. So um, I think that'll be my next destination and then we'll, we'll take it on home after that. So just thought I'd share a little bit of the beauty of San Diego here. So I used to ride almost every Sunday, and uh, I always called it my Sunday services. And, uh, well, I don't really go to church a whole lot anymore, so um, I guess it's I guess it's my way of giving back, you know, showing showing thanks to to the motorcycle gods, as it were, perhaps. But uh, anyway, on that note, this is Mount Soledad. So there you go, a little bit of religion on Sunday. This is a veterans memorial. So I'll get up here a little bit closer and show you all some of the stuff here, but uh, all the, uh, the dark colored uh, tiles that you can see down there are all um, veterans. There's a little bit of information about each one. So it goes all the way around. But uh, what a good view up here today. You can see downtown San Diego, Mission Bay, over here the Pacific Ocean, there's La Jolla where I was just at. There was a lot of um, civil discourse about this monument here. Some atheist organizations didn't like the uh, religious overtones of the, the big T at the top up there. Um, this was city land. I believe it's now a national monument. seen some here. This is all veteran memorials. All the way around the 
this thing. I'm a member of a VFW post here in San Diego, and um, we're named after one of these heroes here, Michael Mansour. And I've seen his, I've seen his little um, uh, tile here. I'm pretty sure it's around the corner over this way. Obviously a very popular destination here. It's nice. Sitting up on top of the hill. Let's take a look out here at the ocean. Couldn't ask for a much nicer day than today. Very glad I got to get out and ride. about 200 miles, not bad. Stopped and had a Shake Shack, first time there. Uh, not overly impressed, but uh, it was okay. I guess if it hadn't been such a long wait, it was immensely popular, so obviously it's good. Hey, well, I ain't gonna fault them for being a successful business. But uh, I had to park way down. Well, not way down, it's not too far. A lower parking lot. I rode through here twice. They don't have a motorcycle spot. And I thought about just being a rude motorcyclist and parking uh, in a little corner somewhere. But uh, I try not to, try my hardest not to do too many things to give motorcycles a bad name. So I'll take the little jaunt back down here and uh, I'll bring it on home. And we'll see if there's anything else I got going on today. So we'll see you back at the Global Domination Headquarters. All right, well, it's good to be back in the uh, Global Domination Headquarters here. There you go, check this out here. Employees must wash hands. My buddy thought it'd be kind of funny to put some signs up. I think I got another one on the back side of, back side of this door that says, men. Let's take a look here, I think it's still there. Although I don't, I don't like the term uh, man cave. I don't dig that term, but uh, I guess it says men, so. Oh, that's all right, my wife comes in here too. Thank you very much for joining me on the um, adventure a little bit today. I know I, I didn't bring you all along in the first half, but I had a couple friends with me who probably didn't really wanna be on the video all that much anyway. But, uh, you know, like I said, we rode, uh, from the city here, up to the mountains, Julian. We caught just the corner of Anza Borrego Desert, not to the ocean. That's the beauty of San Diego, man. You can do all those in one day, not a problem. And uh, then I get home and I had some messages. My buddy who uh, gave me this, this nice little green scooter here, he needs some transportation for a, a cousin or something. So I said he can have her on, have this one back. I mean, I'm. I'm not really using it a lot. I run around the neighborhood with it once in a while, but uh, uh, it's not even really legally registered. So hopefully there's no police watching this video, but if you are, it's too late. I already done the crime. You didn't catch me in action. So it's kind of like the Dukes of Hazzard, right? But uh, I got this other, I got this other scooter anyway. So we'll see what we do with that. And if not, you know, I have more than enough vehicles. Um, but after two days of uh, playing around, watching police ride motorcycles, and then me getting out riding mine, I'm getting a little behind on the chores. So I got this big pile of palm leaves that we got to get out of here and then start on whatever the next project is. There's always something going on here at Tom's Tinkering and Adventures. So I, I hope you'll hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And uh, keep watching, keep commenting. Thank you very much for watching. Get out there and find your adventure. Adios.